Hello, in this video, I am going to show you how to separate out you know, multiple screens into different files. So at the moment, we've got this application. If I click on it, it navigates to the next screen and we can go back using either of the buttons. But as you can imagine, if we have multiple screens and these are simple screens that have a lot of you know, widgets, a lot of layout, a lot of variables, it can get quite complex. So we want to separate it and abstract it out. To do that, it's really simple. If we go to the lib folder, right click it, go to new, dart file, and just create your second page. So I'm gonna call it second page. You'll add the dart, dot, dart extension. So from main, let's grab everything that's related to the second page and cut it. It just happens to be just that, but it could be linking to other classes potentially. And we put it into here, so we're getting some errors. So, you know, what are these errors talking about? And the reason is, uh, this will try and help. So it's because we haven't got a certain library imported. If we go to main, if you look pretty much from the start, the template had this imported. So we need to copy that and put that there. That has fixed all the errors, but there are still some more errors. And this one is because the second page class, which is this one right here, is no longer in the same file, so we can't access it. It's simply the same problem as this, because this was in a different file, and we didn't include it, could I access this? But if we do import, and we do second page dot dot, which is this file here, if it's in separate folders, you just, you know, essentially navigate to it, put a semicolon. Now if we save, and to confirm it is still working, I'm going to say second page is awesome. And for the first page, I'm going to say, what do you actually say at the moment? It says epic page. I'm going to say epic page is amazing. So to show you, it's got the new updated version. Epic page is amazing. I click it. Second page is awesome. And we have it working the same way. It, it, it is separated in two files. And that's really all there is that you need to know. You can have as many files as you want. And it's good, I wouldn't say to have a million files or unlimited files, but to separate the content out. So that way, if something goes wrong, and let's say this is a home page, this could be a settings page, you could have an account page, and there's you know something happening on the account page, you go to the account page dot dot, and there you go, you can you know, look at that code instead of having to look at hundreds or thousands of lines of code, you could reduce it to potentially 50 or so lines. That's it, if you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message, and as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.